Hey, good morning. Happy good Wednesday. Morning. How's everybody doing today? It is Wednesday all day. I think I say that. Do I say that every show? I think so. I bet probably. if I look back, it would be there. You know, I can't see <laughs> through these glasses. I haven't worn them yet today. Ahoy hoy, tricky luggers. Hope everybody is having a good day. Ahoy hoy. I know uh -oh. that uh, Logan I know escaped. Logan is because he has escaped. He heard the he heard the greeting and here, had pal. to come had to come and uh, give his opinion. <laughs> so I hope everybody's having a good day today. I'm just trying to make sure that we don't look sickly. You know, it's interesting how different these things happen, like all the time. They're always different. It's very strange. The what settings. Things? Oh, the settings. We were just oh, browsing yeah. again about the settings and how they love to change. You know, they'd have you believe that binary doesn't change when you're not looking, but oh, it's gosh darn load. it, it does. It's such a load. I think gamma rays come in directly and hit our computer at night so uh let's say hey let's see who's oh, in the stream oh, today all right albert lee is here aubrey kovach brickanista hey, naomi bricky's club uh brickworm uh chris oh, brickworm. games maker chalice london 2012 eight years today you know chris i think i'm gonna have to start like looking at your names yeah. ahead of time so I can make sure I can say them all. I think Horn we should go back to that one again, all right? Chris Gamesmaker, Chal you're supposed to be saying it with me. You go, you go ahead. Are you going to drink no the coffee? Oh my goodness. Chris Gamesmaker, Chalice, London, 2012, eight years today. There you go. Uh, Cornado, how's it going? Corey, Dan, Dan Bakken. Hi, Dan. Chewbacca is here. Debo Bricks. Uh, Great Brick Lab, a new name. Haven't seen you before. Welcome. welcome. Everybody give a big uh, Tricky Lug welcome to Great Brick Lab. Hooded One, Insane Legos Fan, JMW uh, Music. Oh, did you get Fabufan MKE? Oh, no, Fabufan MKE just popped in too. Very good. Uh, JMW Music, uh, John Luttrell, Corey, Corey Kinnick. Corey Kinnick. Hey, Corey. Uh, Marilyn Parmley. Hi, Marilyn. Mark. Mark Krupshank. Mark, Mark is Krupshank. here. Hi, Mark. Gosh, we sure miss you around here. I've been loving the pictures you posted, like that one of you and Boone building um, crazy things in your house. So fun. Yes, uh, Minifig Chick and Moto are here. Not, no one in between today. No. Very interesting. Right next to one another. Um, Orange Briggs is here. Robert Zaccardi. Shane, Shane LeVan. Hi, Shane. Zisei is here. Hi, Zisei. Zisei Hagginsby is here. The Brick Orphanage. The Mowgli. Uh, Wilfred. Wilfred. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Nice to see you. Zach Martinez and, and Alyssa. Alyssa. Hi, Alyssa. Good to see you. And I want to say a um, a big happy birthday, happy birthday to Zach Martinez. It's Yay, birthday. Zach Martinez! And a he's big here. Bring it round out with of us. applause. Yes. Hey, I'm fiddling with this thing here. I found it when I was cleaning up today. And look at this. Isn't this a nifty little thing? It's just an axle going into a Technic brick, right? No. Because if you take off this other one, you see it's an axle with a nail that goes through it. And we know how cool those are. But what I didn't used to know is there's room to lock that in so it'll never, ever come out. Hmm. There you go. Tip of the morning. The stuff that you find. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, when you clean up the jumble, right, of things. Yes, exactly. Yeah, I've been cleaning the studio, uh, trying to make it a little bit more feasible for stuff well you know, to, teaching be a, to be a classroom and to be a and classroom and an actual like functioning room that is yep. not horrible <laughs> oh, we have elbow room now hey disney pins i oh, have this yes. one and actually our disney pins are related today are they um yes oh, i didn't know that so this one flynn has worn before i'm liking it i'm feeling like it's this kind of day today let's see is it gonna focus oh Oh, well. Sorry, you can tell. That's Pluto in a teacup. I think, yes, t Clicky, thank, thank you. you. Clicky. If you can help us with that before, it would be awesome. That would we appreciate your help. Yeah, we do. Um, although, I wonder if he can, if he'll be able to do that or not. Oh, look we'll at that. See. Okay, let's see. Hang on, let's see. Is that going to work? Yay! Yes, thank thanks, you, Clicky. Clicky. That was not set up. That wasn't <laughs> set up. <laughs> that was help from our friend. We wouldn't do that. Um, and I am wearing, and I know I've worn this before, but I'm wearing my Alice pin today. And for a very good reason. Um, if we would have been here yesterday, um, you would have known that it was in 1951, yesterday in 1951, Alice in Wonderland premiered in New York City. 
in the movie theater. Mm. So, um, yeah, so we're kind of celebrating a little bit of a day late. I posted yeah. on our Instagram, I posted my Alice in Wonderland piece. One of my favorite um, things that you've made, and it was an early one, too. It was right? a really early one. Yeah. I wasn't, like, <laughs> I peaked early. Hey, look, apparently. check this out. Brick Superman. Look at this. Oh, and you've got, like, a, yay. You Who have made this one? Will Heron. Yay, Will Heron. Speaking of which, I'm going to have some coffee. Yes. Oh yes, I got my I got my skeleton shirt. See, that was today. my version. That was my square version of Superman right there. <laughs> but the shirt is super cool and not square at all. Uh, ahoy, hoy, uh, uh, Miss welcome. So, gosh, we have a few things to um, to go through today before we get to the model. We do, so, and I can't wait. We had this great idea yesterday for a model. I can't wait. Yes, we're really, uh, I'm very, very excited about this. This is like, we talked about on Monday, we were like, maybe we'll put together a vintage model. And we really only got like two, maybe yeah. three. But this one is actually really, has a great story. Um, it is missing a few of the pieces, which I'm hoping. That's okay, we're we going to fill source, it out. Because now I want to source those pieces yeah. and, and get them get them back, especially the minifigures. Um, so what are we doing now? So, but right now, we are going to take a look at... This amazing oh, piece of artwork that I yay. that I definitely that I want to be able to show off. Okay. So here we go. Uh, we were gonna go this, there. Are we gonna go there? Let's see. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Dump. So and we it have JMW Music, aka Joriel Builds on Instagram, has done this amazing mosaic of super sewer super baby super sewer baby and i was so excited when i was scrolling through my um through instagram this morning to see this i was like <laughs> okay we have to feature this um we're really happy about that so oh look zach martinez really <laughs> likes your down the rabbit hole piece. oh thank you zach and happy birthday again mm. these mosaics make me so happy you know i i got a lot more into mosaics once i started actually doing them right and you know it's funny dots got me into that and I wanted to I wanted to show you this too. Well, so not only does he have other great stuff, but I did want to show you just uh, briefly here. What's that? That I, w I so I went scrolling through my um, look at those cute animals. Oh my goodness, I want them all. Um, I was scrolling through my um, Instagram feed this morning, and yes, look at that. Look, look how at much Lego thing. is in your Instagram. feed. Look at that. That thing, almost Moto. looks like I a hope you're Moto looking at this creation. Right now. I know. Me. I know. Um, wow, that makes me think of, of um, uh, oh, darn it. What's that? What's the movie where the silver there ball, we go. where the silver ball flies around? Phantasm. And the big, tall phantasm. Big, phantasm. tall, scary guy. Wait, who did one? Was that you? Was that your sphere? Holy bananas. Okay, I got to go back to that because. Yeah, there. Oh, it is. I didn't even, that I wasn't even looking. So I'm so sorry, cool. hooded one. I am so Sorry that I just breezed by that. I love this piece. Um, this is amazing. Yeah, yeah. This it, is amazing. It's so cool. I think maybe this might have to become a new feature, like the Instagram viewer Instagram feature. Where oh, we, like, I like show that. Off, well, I um, love seeing what other people make. Absolutely. And am I seeing that those um, that those triangular pieces are attached by clips? That are underneath the medium azure rectangles. Yeah, this is really that's really cool. cool. How I bet that took a while to get that to all fit. Thanks, just, hooded uh, one. And cool. yes, I think that's going to be a new thing. All right, that is a new. That's going to be a new feature. Hooray, more sharing. Uh, viewer Instagrams, and we will we'll be doing we'll be doing that. Um, okay, so anyway, this was what I. <laughs> I mean, this I saw the sphere, of course, but this is where I was at. It's like the Groucho Marx of clickies. Um, so this is from Brickworm. Um, this clicky is amazing. Um, clicky with twirly mustache. I am super into this version. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it makes uh, me really happy. I can't happy. tell if he's heroic or sinister. I know. It's what do you think? I guess it depends on the background music. And Pretty then, cool. and then, Clicky is astonished. Whoa! <laughs> wow! He can't even believe what's going on. <laughs> Looks like maybe he was out behind the gym with that Mickey pen that I had. Uh, have oh look, and Matthew Ashton of course posted some My Little Ponies, and Yay, why not? We love Matthew uh, Ashton. Oh, and there's BX Bricks. BX. This is um, Jermaine from Lego Masters. This is um, Dinobots Transformers. What a great the, guy! And yeah. he is. Like crazy about Transformers. He he just finished like two hundred of them or something. 
So, um, oh, he's got well, you have a fun on. Instagram that's very heavily influenced by Lego. You think? <laughs> it's like my you Facebook think? feed. It's great. <laughs> anyway. All the Lego um, news that's fit to print. Hey, Aqua Mike TV, thanks for joining. How's it going? Um, but yeah, I am I am super... I have to write that down. I have to okay, write that here. down so I don't forget a, it. Oh, no, we don't have the official pad. What happened to our that's official okay. pad? Maybe I... Um, maybe I... Oh my goodness, who? I, well, I cleaned up too well. Look, here's apparently. another one that says, A note to you from Richard Borg. Christopher Coster is here. Hey, Christopher, how's it going? Oh, and by the way, everyone. Yes. Uh oh. By the way, thanks to Christopher. And I just read the email this morning and I haven't had a chance to respond back to it yet because it looks like, and I'm not promising anything, but it looks like next Wednesday we are going to have Tiago Caterino on the show. Yay! Um, and we're going to interview him oh, about so his, about all of his work at Lego and what he's done since he's leaving Lego. And it's really exciting, and y'all. One of the things he worked on, if you'll notice, he a yes. TC there, right? Can, I don't know. Yeah, he did. There's so, a TC. I'm not going to turn it right. Yeah, so he did the redesign of Jake Sadovich's um, Ship in a Bottle set, which is, you know, as we all know, amazing. Um, yes, and he has right. his own YouTube channel, which is also amazing. Um, whoa, uh, Ms. Things. Uh, Demonstrating. Things, things blew off. And if you remember no, this. No, her ring wasn't finished, so I made it fly off. If you remember this. I'm going to go back here, and I'm going to pull out this piece. Oh, goodness. From the haunted house and check it out. Why don't you come sit down? Because everybody can now see the bag full of pieces back there. Oh, sorry. Hey, you <laughs> You're know, like we, the only one. <laughs> you know what? We build stuff in this room. Um, and Tiago, uh, and he oh, got they used yeah. the print of his name. We're just gonna give up. Oh, on come it. on, We're really? Gonna, you gotta put your hands over it, like people. Oh my god, did that actually work? Yes, it did. It actually did. And we clicky, put clicky, clicky up helped. and it worked. Okay. I didn't put clicky up. Clicky just shows up. Oh, I had no idea. Um, yeah, so uh, yeah, so I love it that they used his little and I believe now the organ inside of the haunted house is called the Caterino organ, so I'm pretty sure that was like based on his design. What are you looking for? Oh. So I'm pretty sure that was um, that was based on on his design. So, um, oh, uh oh. So Ms. we Thing? have a visitor. We have a visitor. Miss Thing. Um, we're, we have a visitor today. Oh, oh, oh my oh. goodness! Everybody, look! It's we've been waiting for this for a while. She has it finally is, arrived. It is Angela. It is Angela. It is Miss Thing's goth sister, Angela. She is yeah. very, she's very goth. What you brought can tell. her? The tombstone. I think the tombstone. I think she was attracted by the talk of the the tombstone. You can see how goth she is from her very glamorous fingernails. Yeah, I think she she's. We're gonna have to set her up with a. Yeah. Um, we're gonna have to set her up. Oh wait, look, I think um Ms. Thing's been waiting a while for this to happen and yeah. Oh look, they're oh. together they're together again. And for you the can first tell time. This is Ms. Thing because she has her dots bracelet. Yes, on. you can tell well and she also has the she has the fake nails. Yeah. She doesn't have I mean sorry, they're not fake. Sorry. She doesn't okay. have the nails. Do you know right. how punk and goth Angela is? She is so punk and goth that she has black electrical tape fingernails. That's what I'm saying. That is pretty. Oh right. Goth. Well, I guess they're going. I guess they're gonna go hang out and catch what? up. It's been a little while. Well, I think Ms. Thing was talking about a project for Angela, right? Oh yeah, actually a, a part I, of the show. Yeah. So Angela, I think may actually start introducing a new uh, a new feature that we're yep. gonna be doing. So yeah, new new features all over. All right. So she there you is go. she is punk and goth. It depends on the day. <laughs> Same. It's true. <laughs> same. It depends on whether she's angry or sad. She does need her. She does. She will get. She will absolutely get a ring, and she will get her own dots bracelet. She has. Yeah, she's getting um, a, a pretty black, good of course. Black dots bracelet. Black, of course. So guess what? Back together again. Two more episodes, y'all. What's Two that? Two more episodes until our one hundredth episode. Oh, we are we... Sub- celebrating our one hundredth episode this Sunday. 
Um, and we are we are so excited. Uh, we've got a bunch of stuff going on. We've got some prize packs to hand some, out. Some surprises. Yes, I said surprise packs. More than one. Multiple, can you imagine? Because there, I have, um, we've just had um, a couple of viewers uh, contact us to, to um, donate some things to give away for the 100th episode. Yep. So, so we're super here. excited about that. So be, be here, here on that episode. On Sunday, because you must be present to win on Sunday for hmm. the 100th episode. This reminds me, I'm finally, I'm going to go to our Redbubble store because I saw, who was it? Was it Shane who had? Someone yeah, had a Logan, Logan Cookie, Cookie Time, Time coffee mug. cup. Yes, and it's I true. Want one. All right. So I think it might be time for... Yay! Oh. Wow, this is a very special Sticker Time show and tell today. This is pretty cool. So this, set. this one is from Brickworm. And I gotta say, by the way, today alone, and this has never happened, today I received like four different emails with sticker sets on them. Yep. I am so excited. Um, this is, uh, this is, it, this is like, it... I don't know. It makes me very happy that people are participating. I love the classic space stickers in this. Um, and as you can tell by that chicken and flower, maybe, this is from 1980. Um, this is from the Lego Ideas Book 6000. It's 26 by 18.5 studs, and it's one of two sticker sheets. This is the second one. Right, and it looks like, um, uh, and they are well-loved. Brickworm has has used a few of Some them. Some of them have been used, yep. Um, but I am in love with the fruit and the flowers and that like little array of like the apples and carrots yeah, and everything. And the mechanic sign is so sweet. The cow is hilarious and looks very concerned. Um, right, by the so milk. there wasn't a lot of computer aided design. In no, this, these are a lot of. Right? This looks very hand drawn. Right. Um, and here are the the classic space uh, stickers that are at the My bottom. My favorite are part. Fantastic! I know, Wilfred, right? It is Lego history. Yeah, it's really, um, uh, this is a really terrific set. And thank you, Brickworm, so much for um, for sending those in. That's we awesome. We love stickers. Hey, I, I Orson the... is here. That... Oh, hoi, 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 Gwyneth. Good to see you. <laughs> oh, this is awesome. How fun. Sorry, we can get back to that. I just had oh, to I, I, I saw some some likes from Gwyneth and some stuff on your Instagram feed. Yes. Yeah, yes. but I just, I love this spaceship with the few plates, you know, and um, and the overprinting in the um, the classic space helmet there is so, like, silkscreeny. Yeah, it's really, um, it's really pretty great. Hooray! So hooray! There's oh, the um, and this sticker set sells for somewhere between twelve and thirty five dollars, depending on where you get it. That's crazy. I know. That's crazy. Yeah, it's hard to find vintage stickers because everyone wants to use them, right? Oh, and I got to tell you, Fabu fan MKE, that we went on to Bricklink the other day and we put like, I don't know, a ridiculous amount of money down. Um, in a shopping cart for Fabuland stuff. Oh, coming yeah. From, coming from the Netherlands. Now, I have sent a note asking for a um, uh, an approximation of the shipping. on the shipping because yep. I'm kind of terrified it's going to be a lot. And if it's like, you know, yeah. if it's too much, we're going to have to say no. But we put... And you know... Yeah, a good like ninety dollars worth yeah. of stuff. In maybe the cart. you all, maybe you we'll all see. could help us out here. Actually, um, I think it was either Bill Ward or I can't remember who it was. Does a lot of international orders of Lego and says mm -hmm. that some countries are easier for shipping to the United States and others yeah. than others. And I think I thought he said Germany was one of them. But if anyone knows, we're looking far and wide for cool pieces. Oh goodness! Um, uh, oh hooded one, awesome. Thank you. We appreciate that. <laughs> um, yeah, so they do ship cheaper from Europe than the U.S., but I don't know. I Like I said, there's like a lot of big like wall panels and window things, and clearly somebody took apart um, the Ferris, a bunch, wheel, the Ferris right? wheel set and then like is selling it all as separate pieces, which I'm totally okay with. We got all the pieces for We're it. We're so. trying to do the whole Ferris wheel, and then we'll assemble it on the show. I think it's going to work. Yeah, I'm very We have I'm most of the pieces. Very excited about that. Um, all right, so... Should we build something today, see. Flynn? What's that? Should we build something today? I think we should build something today. All right. Um, so, 
Mm, yeah, there is a lot of Fabuland in Europe. I mean, that's kind of where it is. Like, there, all the stuff that you find here is not awesome. You know, I, awesome. I later found that it, it was a much more subtle place, but my first experience so. of, of Switzerland was kind of like Fabuland, right? I arrived in a train station perfectly on the second on time, and it was clean and bright and shiny and beautiful like a train set. It felt like I was entering Fabuland. Yeah, I... I <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> you right there? You got a frog caught in your throat. Hello. Um, yeah, I'm doing all right. Hello, my okay. baby. Hello, my so, so we are going to start building this set. So this do you know what set it is, is yet? I do know what it is. No, and you know what? They? I know you know what it is. Oh, I know. I, well, if they saw the... Um, Oh, it's no surprise. It's yeah. I was gonna say if you saw the if you saw the thing, then you probably know what it is. Well, should I be getting some bricks while you're getting this um, graphic up here? Yeah, you know, I just realized that I didn't. I I am such a silly guy, and silly I, goose. Well, there was so much going on this morning, as you know. I bet you didn't forget much. <laughs> Look, I'm pulling out. Can you guess? I'm pulling out gray in Ziploc baggies. Very nice. A couple of pieces of Lego string. So it is the it is the Knight's Castle. Yay! From 1984, uh, which is pretty cool. And I'm going to I am just going to do this real quick. Excuse me, Angela. <laughs> I am. Look at this. I am crazy. Oh, yeah. It just said we'll be back in a minute. We're actually yep. still here, all in all. Wow. See, that's crazy. Look at that. Anyway, um, well, the things that we try to do, it doesn't always work out, but we do our best. So last night... Um, oh, so somebody was asking yes. about... Um, yeah, that was like... Are you all right there? Yes. So somebody <laughs> was asking about viewer mail. You're like and, that um, with the spiral eyes. By, I, I am. And by the way, uh, Orson, yes, we, we, we usually do viewer mail. If we have viewer mail, we don't have any yet. We've kind of gone through all yeah. of it. But I saw today that we have no less than four packages arriving at our P.O. box. So I'm oh, very yeah. excited about that. Sorry it takes a little bit. We're not going outside super often lately, but we're going every week. Oh. And we also got emails from people asking questions that I haven't had a chance to answer yet, but I'm going to get to them. Yes. Um, I'm interested in your questions. Oh, so um, Asorg is here. That's a new name. Welcome. Yeah. Welcome. Everybody say uh, hello to that, uh, to our new viewer. Give him a, a welcome. Hello. Wow, Angela's already, like, up in there, right? Yeah, She's well, she has it. a history on the stage. <laughs> She's show folk. So, what are we looking at? Oh, so we yeah. So we are doing this. Um, this is night from 1984. It is it's called Knight's Castle. This is um, now. This are, there is a story behind this actually, and I'm going to uh, yeah. Let's go to down cam while I pull some of these out. With this, I'm going to do this. Whoa! Fancy schmancy. I know we never use this one. Look at that. But we get these printed castle pieces there those are pretty cool yeah so this is um this is pretty cool so this story behind this is when we first started doing lego i had gotten uh we had picked up the the bulk lego and i knew and i knew i wanted to get richard lego for his birthday so i i hooked up with my friend tina and i was like tina she is she had talked about having this set and i was like tina do, if you still have that set do you think your mom would pack it up and send it to us um, to give to Richard for his birthday if nobody's using it. And she's like, oh, yeah, of course. So her mom, like, put it back together. We love Tina's mom. And sent it to us. Um, she's the one that got us those awesome um, Treasure of the Snake Queen mugs. Oh, yeah. <laughs> sent us the, um, the set, and we put it together. It was really fun. And then it, and then it sat, and we decided that it would be fun to put that uh, back together today. One of the pe yeah. one of the um, the sets that really started our um, that was at the beginning of our Lego journey, if and you will. You can tell. Um, I don't know if you can tell here, but this is an old vintage gray piece, and this is a newer, shinier gray piece. We tried to have as many of these 
original vintage pieces as possible. Hi, Osorg. Welcome. And um, yes, it's not your first time. You don't comment much. That's totally fair. But yeah, we don't, you know, if, when people don't comment, we don't know. So we just assume that they're but new. But we like the people thank who you don't for comment too. All of you are so welcome. We're so glad you're here. So I want to know we don't, we don't, you know, know in the moment you're here. Right. So I want to show you, I, I want to show you the, um, I don't know if I can actually. So the instructions are very different than modern instructions. They don't show you the, um, here, actually, I think I am going to try and show you the instructions because oh, I think you would find it interesting. Um, in just the difference between, let's see if I can make this work. I'm actually going down to since we have the time. There's not that many pieces in this set, right? Right. So this is the... Here's a picture of the castle, right? Number 6073. Six, six, so this was our friend Tina's when she was a kid, and she said that she was always so um, sad about the Lego commercials because they had Zack the Lego Maniac, but that there was no girl, and that she oh. considered herself to be a Lego Maniac, and she wanted to be... She didn't um, see herself on screen. She didn't see herself on screen. So... Real quick, so you can see these, and check it out. Here is the first page of the instructions, and you can see that there's no, you don't, it doesn't show you what pieces that you need, and it shows the pieces already kind of like, there's at least what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pieces here all at once with no little list. Wow, right? you had to be smarter <laughs> in the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, you had to be, uh, you had to be, you did, you had to be like more together somehow. Um, I don't know how we got by, but we did. We called our parents. <laughs> right. Right. So anyway, we're going to, I'm going to go ahead and start trying to piece some of this together. Like I said, it's funny when you don't have the, uh -oh. um, the this benefit is, of knowing which exact piece you're supposed to use. This is a fake one by one cube. It's made of three plates. I think we can accept it, but we don't. No, really it's probably need to, because right? we had plates that we need for the model, and they were probably just stuck together. Oh, you my think? guess. Look, there's yes. a there's a headlight brick stuck in there too, and there's is that one of Richard's eyes? There's an angry gray eye right here. No, an angry gray eye. Let's we see. We can start assembling whenever yeah, you want. Yeah, I'm just that. playing with blocks. <laughs> Yeah, where do we have the, um, we're going to need the Technic bricks. There should be a couple Technic bricks with hole, and there should be oh, a couple of Technic pins. Uh, so people were smarter in the 80s. They were reading books and instructions. It's true. Well, I mean, I don't know about that they were smarter, but they certainly read a lot more books. <laughs> in my opinion. Okay, so are the um, Technic bricks with hole? Or they are Technic bricks with hole, and they what are color light are they? gray. And we are also looking for some pins. Wait, I don't think we pulled those, Flynn. Um, I don't see any Technic brick with holes in gray. Um, I did but for I sure pull, pull them. them, but we can look. We can sure we can pull them. You again want to pull if others? To. I'm gonna go ahead and. Did you check in here? Well, these are plates. All right, here we go. Yeah, this one is like this one's not even connected okay, right now. It's literally asking got... us to. We need a second one and then the pen. So yeah, you just got jumbled together. And I'm gonna put this here. A, a second one. And like I mentioned before, we are missing some of the pieces. So, but you not know, most of the building pieces. No, right? no, we we've got a little, pen or two. little specialty pieces are are missing. We have. One, two. I think this is right. All right, so I just you want to go connected these up? together. Sure. Let's see. Let's move this over here. I know, Zarakina, you're already like queen of the books, right? <laughs> you got, you got it all going on with the books. All right, here we go. Oh, I see. Some of these were already assembled from when we received it, right? Yeah, when we and we took it apart and put it back together, and then right. we were taking it apart again. So, okay. all right, there is there's that, and now we're looking for hinges. Okay, are you looking for one by two gray hinges? The bricks, yeah, the hinge bricks. Um, I had those a moment ago. Where, where are you going? I just need these to build with. Oh, well, I think those... Oh, here's the hinge brick. 
Awesome. All right, so there's a hinge here because you know the whole th the whole thing opens up. And this part, I love it that this part, these two parts here are still not connected in any way. They're just it's sitting just there, like hanging, hanging out. out. <laughs> um, I'm refill coffee, Flynn. Okay. Do you want more? Uh, sure. Why not? All right. So now I'm gonna put these these pieces all together. Look at that. No, it's normal green. It does look weird on screen because we're pulled in really close up. Um, I can try and... Yeah, it's regular. The color um, sometimes can be a little wonky. I can see if I can adjust it a little bit if, if it looks weird. I don't want it to look weird. Well, is the gray neutral? Yeah. <laughs> Let's see if we can do this. I have it brightened up a little bit. Let's pop. Let's do this. Let's see. Oh no! Now my hand's turning red. Well, sorry guys. You're just gonna have to. Yeah, we'll have to live with the weird green. Well, you can trust us. These are real Lego. Yes, colors. these are real Lego colors. They're just not as awesome as they could be on the on that end. All right. It's not just good, it's good enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I, could, I guess I could change the white balance on it. Yeah, we want a neutral. It's going a little bluer. I don't know yeah. here, I think we can. Yeah, oh, my I think goodness we're gonna gracious. have to just live with it. That looks better a little bit. Yeah, crisp. I think we're just gonna have to live with I it. I think we're gonna stick with that. We still look human, right? Look at that. All right. I have a semi-true skin tone there. Okay, so we've got that together. Sorry, everybody. I know. Hey, it's, back to Lego. I know it's not um, always the most perfect picture. You know but what? We're doing our best. Having a seat of your <laughs> pants production show casting worldwide is never having to say you're sorry for technical problems. Um, we we are going to need two uh, one by two bread bricks, please. Okay. Mark. All right. Besides, it's on it's on Moto's bingo card. <laughs> it is. <laughs> uh, right. Did you actually you didn't attach the oh sticker whoops there. that's probably a good idea right? Yeah, these instructions are so weird. Okay, here, so now we need one over here. Now we need eight two by two um, gray bricks, which are right here. What is Chris mm -hmm. Chalice saying? I want you... Oh, you rebuilt the dragon castle. That's cool. With the dragon head on the side. Three missing pieces. Yeah, those missing pieces. At least, hopefully, they were normal building bricks. You want to put these border one by two. Oh, is this on? like crenellation or something? It looks like it. It looks like there's a corner piece, too, right here. And then... Wow, they really... There we go. This is so confusing. One. I feel like I missed this something. This is wrong, Flynn. Hmm? I'm supposed to have only two bricks here, but I have um, four bricks here. I mean, four, five studs. I think this piece is the wrong length or something. It, it's, it is possible. Look, one, two, there's three. Yeah, there's one three. Two. There's, that's so because... Wait, there's three studs. You can't see it because of the way the... Oh, they're there's hidden! There's three. Yeah, there's in actually the three studs. In the orthographic view. Uh, yeah. Orthography. See how that is. Okay, and then there's three studs <laughs> here, right? Look at this massive progress we're making on this model. I find this funny. It's like, you know... it's This is almost like one of those, um, those videos where they try and... Get teenagers to use the telephone, like I a was dial phone. The same thing. You're like, what do you do? The numbers don't have buttons on them. I have no idea what's happening. Well, we this part, some... this part turns around. What do you suppose that's for? We do need some corner pieces, however. I love the sound of a dial phone. Uh -oh. <laughs> it is. Um, Flynn, I hate to do this, but I'm yeah. gonna have to step away for a moment. Okay. Okay. Absolutely. Bye, everyone. I'll be right back. All right, let's see. I'm gonna no, there aren't any corner pieces. There are these. <laughs> I know there is. There's like 25. You're right. There's like 25 steps for the whole set. It's ridiculous. Um, this is very very silly, everyone. All right, I'm gonna see what I can do about getting us a little bit closer, but not too close. There we go. So you can kind of see what's going on here. We are absolutely still not connected now we're finally going to connect this piece here which is good because wow 
This is so weird. I've never, um, I've never experienced building like this before. All right, so now we're gonna put in a whole bunch of these these pieces, and these are those, you know, castle things. You know, those little castle walls. They are ubiquitous. Um, okay. Okay, this is weird. Hmm, now I feel like I did something wrong. Okay, I know that these go here, and they're supposed to be... Wow, this is really confusing, you guys. <laughs> this is so embarrassing, I have no idea. I have no idea what's going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness all right here we go how's it going there it's go <laughs> it's going all right. all right it's just really yeah this is just really weird it's a very funny build okay so we're finally getting pieces held together using these castle pieces there are so many gaps in here um, like this. Like, this is only held together right now by that one stud. All right? <laughs> I'm sorry. All right. Oh, my goodness, you guys. This is so ridiculous. All right. And, if, and, and also, it doesn't help that I'm looking at, like, a scanned photograph of you know, a scanned photograph of old instructions that were already, you know, had, like, that were already printed very differently than what we have now, so. <laughs> this is very silly. All right, uh, I've got that here. And now I'm gonna, let's see. Wow, it's very hard to find there, nope. It's still, here we go. All right, there's this here. And we're going to add a couple of one by twos here. And three black tiles. Now I feel like I can kind of get a little bit of a groove on. And it looks like we're looking at two one by two plates like stuck together. Um, the Tricky Lug Youth to help with the vintage sets. Maybe. I think it's, I think you need a Tricky Lug, Tricky Lug people who have, just have experience with putting these things together because, wow, it's very confusing. Um, all right, here's one. And then we're going to do a second one. Hi. Someone is here a little bit early for his favorite part of the day. He's resting his head on my leg, which means he's waiting for something. That's always the way. Um, all right, so I've got my two plates there. I've got this here, and it looks like I think I'm ready to move on to the next step. It's going to have like 25 steps. <laughs> um, okay, this should be. This shouldn't be too hard. Now they do, thankfully, with these black pieces. Um, on the instructions, they do kind of show you, here I can show you um, how it looks over here. They do show you on the black pieces that there's a gap kind of like, in, you know, there's like a little white line in between all of the pieces. So thank goodness for that. All right. So I'm going to do two, one, two, and three. And then it looks like it's going to get a black one by one plate and a black one by one plate with a clip sticking out like that. And then a, oh, I got to make sure I'm facing it the right way here. And then I'm putting a, here we go. Yes. I'm putting a, an inverse slope. And then I'm getting another one by one black and another inverse slope it's funny you know for the longest time i didn't i didn't consider this particular kit part of our lego journey i think because um i think mostly because 
I don't know. We just we. We didn't put it together originally, and it wasn't like the f a first set that we got. And I sort of feel like we can't really say we we put together vintage sets when we don't really put together vintage sets. Um, so I don't know. It's just one. It's just one that I never thought about. Oddly, I don't know why. <laughs> okay, so here we go again with this weird sort of. We're gonna start with this, right? It's see. This weird lining up of pieces is something that you don't see very much anymore on um, in these Lego instructions. Wow, this part's confusing, you guys. I gotta. I don't know if I can make it any larger. It is okay. It looks like I'm doing this. Well, I kudos to anybody who is, who put these together in the past and did it all correctly because I'm <laughs> I'm so confused. Okay, there's those, and then it looks like and I'll have you know that we went through the parts list last night and made sure that we had everything. <laughs> it was like part of our part of our homework for last night. Um, there and here. So just as a reminder, we are doing, we are in the middle of doing our 25-piece um, challenge. So your challenge is to build a model that is 25 pieces or less. Um, and you have a, we have a couple of, well, I don't want to say stipulations. They're actually, uh, they benefit you. <laughs> and that is you may have one base plate for free, something you use as a base. That's a free piece. You don't have to count that. And minifigures, meaning leg assembly, torso assembly, head, and either hair or hat counts as one piece, all right? But any accessories or extra stuff that you add count as extra pieces. And um, the mop, uh, I know I keep bringing this up, but the mop is a really good example because the mop is actually two pieces. So make sure that you are taking a look. And I've already seen on Instagram some people posting their um, uh, posting their things, so I'm very excited to see what everybody's going to turn in. And so, don't forget, you can email that to us at. Uh, let's see, I can do this. You can email that to us at Flynn at trickybricks.com, or you can go onto the um, the community tab of our website. I mean, of this. YouTube site, you can go to the community tab, and there is a link to a Google form that you can fill out and upload your image. And actually, if you have a Google account, that is our preferred way of you getting it to us because it streamlines our process preparing uh, for that. So we appreciate that, everybody. Um, goodness, look at all this stuff. All right, here we go. We've got three, and I can't tell if they've put a plate. It doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like they've put a plate on. Gosh, they are not making this easy on me. <laughs> <coughs> Excuse me. There's Instagram leaks, it's true. <laughs> oh, you're right, it is about that time, everyone. Um, thank you for reminding me, and I am going to because I've gonna I have to prep for this now by myself. So I'm gonna um, I'm gonna quickly prep for this. I'm gonna push this stuff back, and it is that special time of the day that we call. Oh no. <laughs> That's right, everybody, it's Logan cookie time. Come on, Bubba. Hooray, it's Logan cookie time. Here's cookie. Very good. All right, look up here. Let's see, here we go. Good boy. And we can catch one? All right. Oh, no, I'm a terrible, see, Richard's way better at throwing it than I am. Hooray, Logan cookie time. <laughs> wow, everything is Everything is screwy today. Good boy, Logan. What a good boy. All right. Okay, so now I'm still working on this piece here. All right. <laughs> he 
He could, except I'd be, I'm afraid he would mess up our beautiful vintage vinyl chair with his claws. <laughs> that, of course, that's my, that's my big concern. All right, so let's uh, head back over here. And I can bring this more into here. And okay, we're continuing on with this really weird, uh, with this really weird process where I'm not exactly sure what's happening, but I'm gonna keep going here. It's having us put tiles on like this. Yeah, so I guess that is, there is no plate here. And I'm gonna put this right here. Now, I are, you, if you remember, I put these this, this one by two plate and these tiles here, and it's having me put this wall in here. Oh, I see, so that this can open independently, I think. There we go. All right, so that's attached in there. Very strange. Because you can, if you look, there's this like floating area right here. Oh, look at that. See, it's held together by one stud. All right, and then that's where we put that in. All right, moving on to the next step. Oh, okay. So this is having me put together a little drawbridge here. Now, one of the things, unfortunately, that we were missing is the winder, which I'm really, really sad about. But we are, in fact, missing the winder. So that's something that we're going to have to that we're going to have to dig out. Um, we have found the string, but not the winder. Um, there we go. All right. Oh, Orange Bricks, you won't be here um, for the hundredth episode. I'm so sorry to hear that. That's a bummer. Mm. Coffee. All right. So there we go. There's our um, nice, and you can tell there's some 1984 dust still on here, I think. All right. And now it's asking me to put these two two by fours, but I can't tell if they are the Technic bricks or not. I mean, the Technic plates or not. I'm not sure. These are the only two by four black things that are here, so I'm gonna go ahead and assume that it's these. I mean, you know what happens when you assume, but I'm gonna do it anyway. All right, and then we're adding on to this end some, you know, I had this kooky idea when we were, when we were getting this set up today that um, I wish that we had a green screen backdrop so we could have some kind of like crazy ridiculous 80s backdrop and like really lots of silly um sound effects you know like that pew, 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 pew. <laughs> you get a warning from streamlabs wait what happens on streamlabs what um what's that so what's happening uh i'm seeing Oh my goodness, I can't even read this. It's going too fast. It's going too fast. Um, oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Talking about when you assume it's true. <laughs> you can't think of like that. Sorry. <clears throat> and then I saw somebody, something too, that somebody was having trouble mailing their, or uploading their file. I know five people have uploaded them already, but I will look and see what's going on with that. Okay, back to the drawbridge. Um, Got some red Technic pieces here, and that's gonna go right here. But apparently there are some red pieces that go here too. One and two. All right, there we go. Just got my little drawbridge. Oh yes, of course these are Technic pieces because you're gonna tie the string onto here, all right? Uh, all right, now it's asking me to, I'm going to stack a bunch of gray cubes. This is going to be very exciting for everyone, I'm sure, um, while I stack these up. But I don't know, I'm kind of having fun building this old vintage set. It's, um, it's a very different experience, <laughs> as you can tell. Um, and I'm trying to do that, I'm trying to use like the old, um, the old bricks as much as possible. Oh, no, there's only three stacks. Sorry about that. 
And then there's going to be um, hinges. I have no idea. Let's find out. I see one by twos. I see oh, a couple of rando pieces here. I see. Maybe it's in here. Maybe it's in here. Oh, gosh, I don't see it in there either. Oh, maybe it's in here. Yes, ta-da! See, so many bowls. This is what happens when you have this many bowls. You start losing track of where things are and how many bowls you have and all that business. So I'm just going to go ahead and keep on keeping on here. And this is weird, too. Check it out. We're doing this, like, um, this weird thing with hinges where we're putting them on before there's actually all of the pieces to attach them to, like this. Hey, Flynn. Hello, you're back. There's been lots of hijinks while I've been gone. Well, oh, oh yes, wow, extra wow. hijinks. Hi, Hi. It's not yes. cookie time yet. <laughs> Is it? Oh, it's past cookie time. It's, oh yeah, we did it already. Oh, you did, yes. oh, okay, good Thank boy. you, Bubba. Hi. All right, he's, he's very he's excited that you're excited. back. Well, because I left and I came back. <laughs> and you right? said hello. <laughs> Okay, down. I know, Richard Sit. Richard had to go work for a little Sit. bit, but he's back. I know, I'm back. And thank goodness, because I've been completely lost. I can get my head back out of the lighting grid that I was in for a few minutes and into a castle. So can I, I see you're surrounded by parts. Can I hand you anything? Um, I, oops, I think I'm just getting caught up here with these weird pieces that they're, that they don't tell you that you're supposed to put on. Shane. That has been the sort of the hallmark of this particular model. There we go. Shane, Logan always wants more cookies. <laughs> <laughs> what, so you think the instructions are incomplete or are they just- Oh no, 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 they're, they're not incomplete. They just float it by there without telling you Yeah, there's just a it. lot, there's a lot that happens that they wow. don't particularly point out. So you really have to be looking at everything on the page to make sure that you- Can you blow it up? No, that's as big as it goes, unfortunately. Uh, I mean, by making your window larger. Uh, no, it doesn't. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't ah, well, like what that. can I do for you? You could add on these panels along here. It looks like, and okay, you're, we're going to. I wanna. I've been wanting to do this, this um, printed window piece here. This is so weird. Oh, it won't come off. Look at that. I've been wanting to do this printed window piece. I, for some reason, I really like um, Lego horses. I want all the Lego armor. Lego horses are awesome. You know, in just like in video games, right? I want all the horse armor. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you have to pay a lot of money in microtransactions for that if I know anything about video games. Well, not in Skyrim. You could get all the so stuff. So it looks like, oh no, Skyrim is where that all started. Oh, really? Way. Yes. Horse armor was a Skyrim thing. One, two. All right, so we need four stacks of two uh, red cubes, and then we need the small one by three arches. Like these guys? That's and then we exactly make those right. flat, right? Yep. Make them nice and flat. Are they, they really only get two bricks on them? That is correct. This red feels old. It is old. It right. has I that can look. tell the the qual the plastic feels different. Right, too. it's a little it's a little different. Um, it feels like the eighties. <laughs> it feels like it feels like the eighties. And then okay, you need a couple of one by threes. You no, know, they are inverse like. slopes. Oh, I, I remember pulling look these out. yesterday. There's one. Uh oh, where's our other one? Do you have it? I don't. We had it yesterday. It's right there. Oh, it's disguised. There you go. Logan is standing here uh -oh. staring at me like something is going to happen. I know. He thinks that you're back, that there's going to be an extra. I think he thinks there's going to be an Occasionally, one time. of us will have fed him, and the other doesn't know, so he gets two meals, and he's very psyched. Yeah. We always have to check in. So what else is going <laughs> on over here? Well, they're having okay, Let's the, come over I'm, onto camera oops, a little. Sorry, I'm noticing all of a sudden that there's all these extra, like, one-by-ones that they didn't, that they just snuck in all of a sudden. Oh, where are right? those? Exactly. I mean, I put them on, but right? Like, you just all oh, of a sudden you just they're there. Have to look at us looking. Yeah, look at us looking like a couple of grandpas. All right. And then it looks like over here, we're pretty hip for grandpas, I gotta say. Hmm. There, It looks like there's a one-by-one one square. 
maybe even two? I don't even right know here? what. Oh, that's that's those ones. The ones that I said were the stealth. You've got them here. That were the stealth plate. Wow. I can't even believe this. Um, all right. There is so... Are we? I'm not going to let a castle set get the best of tricky bricks. No, no, no. Here, I so found some. What happened with... Oh, you found them? All right. I'm just having trouble telling if it's... Can you tell like we're having fun right now? <laughs> <laughs> this is this is totally like those kids trying to use the telephone. It's absolutely that. Oh my goodness. Got a drawbridge. So what happens? I I feel like we came look, you gotta put one here, Flynn. The cube goes right there. Okay. It points it out. Yeah, and then there but I don't understand where this goes. I think it's here. No, here? Yeah. This gets two. It's only one. Is it? Yeah, it's one sitting on top of the of the thing. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's tough. <laughs> this is crazy. It, it is wow, it's crazy. We're like, oh yeah, we'll just build this vintage wow, set. Tina It'll only must take have us been, a hot minute. Tina was a, a building prodigy. Okay, now we get to do some black inverse slope business, right? Yes. I'm all about that. Starting just, on the sides. We've got these corners. These are always good pieces to have, right? These corner. But those aren't, I don't think we're using those just Yeah, yet. look, right there. Oh, okay. On the corners. Um, we're up there, but it doesn't matter. Like I said, the way these constructions go, you pretty much just like put bricks down. There you go. Oh, and they're oh, sneaking in. They're sneaking in. Uh oh, there's See? something. There is something snuck in here too. Look, is there? Uh, oh, it's a cube, isn't it? Yeah, I don't there's know. supposed to be a cube there. I can see it, right there. Wow, okay. they're not. And this is where those pieces are supposed to go. Is right here. Those one by ones go here. Those those stern Lego designers of the '80s. Wow, man, they were like, they were not messing around. They're like, you don't need to look at this. You don't need the instructions. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need the instructions. There's going to be a test. Um, okay, and it looks like there's a two by three brick that goes here. And another one that goes here. Look, there's one. Oh, let's use this vintage one. Yeah. Let me... What, right in here? Yep. I know you can see that's a new one. Yeah. Um, Way different. Is Yellow. that correct? Oh, okay, and now it looks like we're adding in some red pieces. One here, and then a one by two here. All right. Well, in this mostly gray piece, the red and black okay. details are so nice. There we go. I think we might be... Oh, so now it's asking for corner pieces in all of the corners, and I think this doesn't That's actually go here. That's not supposed to be there. That's supposed yep. to be a corner yep. slope. What's it asking and for? There's we also, got those, right? There's also supposed to be one here and one here. Oh, and look, we got some clips showing up here. Oh yeah, some one. It looks like it looks like a one by one clip with a one by one um, plate on top of it. On top? Yes. Okay. So, <laughs> like, so we're only going two plates. We're gonna be shy. Yep. Okay. That's correct. I'm shy. Yep, a clip and a plate. Couldn't you tell? This is beyond confusing. Okay, right, we got that. No, this is awesome. Look, oh, and, and then we got like... one by two. And there's also supposed to be two one by one plates right here. These guys go in there. The two one by one plates go right there on top of each other. I've got one of them. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh, I got another one. Ooh, a vintage one and a new one. Oh, um, look at that. I don't know if you can see. Yeah, put the vintage one on the t on top, I guess. Here, I'll put you the know, vintage gonna one give on it top. An, it's going to give it a and nice modeled feeling. Can you... Oh, our focus isn't going to... This doesn't have focus Show on. there. I'm, oh, the down one doesn't. But there's a ring of plastic. We talked about this yesterday on this vintage piece around the Lego logo. Uh, there's a ring. Let's see. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's where the winder goes. We're going to have some trouble. Oh, I right. know the piece you're talking about. Yeah, and we have it. I know we have it, and yeah. I don't know where. This is what happens when your collection gets me... too big. <laughs> oh, princess problems. 
I know, I know. Wah. Boo hoo, too many bricks. Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, I'm going to look over here in tech and stuff and see if I mistakenly put that in here thinking it was for a. Wow. They are not messing around, you guys. I, I, thought, that, I thought for sure that this was going to be an easy build. <laughs> it's proving to be anything but. Well, with modern constructions that we're used to, it would be easier. Right? right, absolutely. Yeah, you're right. It's not a build, it's a joust. We are jousting with... Here we are, we're jousting with bricks now. Or something like that. This is just... Well, I think... I have let's, no idea what's happening. Mishun, let's bring some, um, let's bring some Unikitty energy to this. <laughs> this is not a problematic build. Here we go. I think that goes there. Logan agrees. Here, you want to help, Logan? Here, you can help. Oh, no. There we go. He's helping. You want to pick out a piece? Okay. Yeah, that's what he wants to do. Yes, he does. He wants to say hi. And it looks like I'm going to put this here to even it up. And there should be another 1x3 um, plate here. There we go. It's going to even that up. What can I get you next? I don't know because I don't know what goes. <laughs> I have no idea what goes here. I know that well, there's here, let's this. Let's put this up here. There's this long piece, but I can't tell if this actually goes on here or not. Because there's also you know, a, there's also some short pieces. You know, I think we can mock that up. You know what? That winder thing there is not a custom piece, is it? Isn't that just bricks with a Technic pinhole in them? I hope y'all are en are enjoying our <laughs> as we're as <laughs> we're deciphering this cuneiform. We need the Lego Rosetta Stone. Oh man, we need something because this is crazy. Here, I think this is gonna do it. And this was the day that everyone unsubscribed from our channel. <laughs> We're all having fun together. Look, I'm gonna. It's not gonna be red, but I'm gonna make the winder mechanism out of this <laughs> blue one here. I think we've broken Flynn. It's like. There have been puns in the chat or something. I don't. The struggle is real, I hooded don't know one. What's happening? Are you uh, serious? It seems like you've got it under complete control to me. Maybe not. All right. Let's see. I think I need a longer axle. I'm gonna try and build this on screen. Does this go? Look, oh I just goodness. made a winder right there. I feel like I need to go back a step. Oh, this winder is not going to fit on three wires. No, I don't think so. Okay, so we're going to make it shallower. I think it's going to work. I think I'm going to have to go have, I'm going to have to go meditate. You need to go lay down? <laughs> I think so. Look, I, I think, think I fit so. this in three. Check it out, Flynn. I made a mechanism mm -hmm. that's, it's not red, sorry. Um, I'll see if I can get red pieces for this, but I don't know if that's where it goes, but we need to be three deep, right? Yeah, it's like a weird, like... It, is it three deep or four deep? Um, yes, we were kids from the 80s, but I wasn't putting together, yeah, as you know, I was like out um, okay, putting on shows on. For, the, for the neighborhood. <laughs> when... To answer that question, I think the winder is four deep, so I'm gonna put a two by four brick on here. Is that mm -hmm. right? Maybe. Yeah, we may have to e end up adjusting it with some plates because I can't tell. It looks like it's three. It's one down and it's two above. Do you want to share these instructions? Why don't you share that sheet of instructions so that people can have the same kind of <laughs> instruction thrill that we're getting. You could share the instructions and pan around on them. Yeah, maybe I could do that. Okay, you have to see this, everybody. I want you to see how confusing this is starting to get. Because 
And we also don't have it on like the world's greatest screen either. So it's sort of like blowing out. Okay, but look at this. Look at this is, look at this is ridiculous. All right. And so it, it's showing this gray, but it's also got all these other gray pieces all the way around that I absolutely cannot tell what was supposed to happen with them. So we go from here, right? So we put on all of these pieces. And we've got that. This is a plate below, so that is correct, right? <laughs> and then it looks like there is a pe there are pieces that go all the way across here. Like like these these pieces. But then it seems like Look, I don't think it's any more, I don't think this winder is any more complicated than this. Oh, a little more. Right, right, it is, it, it is an M.C. Escher to nowhere. That is absolutely the truth. Oh, do we have, maybe we needed, I'm going to modify this. <laughs> I mean, if I had paper instructions, I could look like super close up at it. Oh, you know what I'm going to do? Put it on your iPad and zoom in. Uh, no, actually, I was going to get the magnifying glass. Are you, are you going to take a magnifying glass and hold it I up to a monitor? I am going to take a magnifying glass, and I'm going to hold it up to a monitor, and we're going to see what happens if, like, my head explodes or something like that. Hey, Professor Trelawney. Um, okay, I'm going to just keep trying to make this happen. The best... Well, uh, the I'm not going to dissuade you from your wacky plans. <laughs> oh, look at that. Someone went through, I'm sure it Here's was us, this. and pulled out all of the red one by n plates. Right. All of them. Yep. I remember when we did that. Because okay. We had some project. Right. Seriously, I want like I just want you to know, um I just want you all to know. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're gonna get this together. I just think I just want you to feel us on on this the frustration of this because man, what a kooky kooky craziness. I'm still I need two more. I'm so close to having this almost do I need to go one shorter? This is loose, so I'm gonna put a bushing on either side. All right. Okay, so I need one more plate up. All right, so see how this little this little edge goes around here. And I'm just kind of guessing at this point <laughs> what size they are. All right. And maybe this I'm going to wait. Let me see here. Is this better? Mm, maybe this is the right thing. Like, we should just try doing one with our eyes closed. We would probably do just as well. <laughs> yeah, look. This, we may have to make up for this added height later. But I made... There we go. Very nice. That's not a... It's not oh, it's I not see. We're not even. It, no, it's not. They're a not even looking at no, the table anymore. No, I was trying anymore. to. I was trying to show you. Um, yeah, I was just trying to show people the the pain. Share so the pain. See that real mechanism there? It's got a reel that's a smaller diameter than the associated bricks. But here, that's the reel that we're using for just today, for now. right? And it had a loose axle connection, so I just put these bushings. So we can replace those with real pieces from, you know, fancy places. From fancy places. Like BrickLink. Okay, a three, a two by three. Oh, here it looks I like. Sit on these. I think another two by three, maybe. Wow, it seems like that was, I don't understand, Flynn. <laughs> I don't either. 
<laughs> it's just Look, really confusing. You can see that on either side. Oh, that's a two by three here. This is weird here in this um, corner. Look at the way that is. There's a two by three sticking out. There should be a two by three plate. Oh, a two by on three the on corner. the corner. You're right. You are right, sir. And do we have it? Yeah, there's a two by three right here. Right? And then mm -hmm. there's then there's a drop down. This is stays dropped down here, but this continues. This has this plate. Yeah, see there's and a, something there's, else. There's a piece here that seems to be missing. So wouldn't that be five long though? It would be five long, so I think this is incorrect. <laughs> Terraforming is easier than this. Well, and again, I blame part of this on the fact that these instructions are, you know, oops, not, it, it, you know, we're going from like probably a, a mimeograph. <laughs> right. Well, I think, don't you think, Flynn, that this longer plate here... I know that there's supposed to be an yeah. edge all the way around it. So look, this can is... we just do this? Look, this is an eight and here's a two. And now we've got it all the way across like in the drawing. Sure. And then we do the same thing. Why is this side different? That's what I, I well, this is, so this is supposed to be like the roof of the little jail or whatever, but I never saw that you were supposed to put in another that, that there were anything to put in here. Well, we need another two by three here, which means that we need a plate underneath all of this, right? <laughs> castle hassle, I love it. <laughs> this is a, yeah, this is definitely getting that hashtag, castle hassle. Okay, so I'm just gonna guess here and do this. And then we can fit our two by three on there. There we go. And it's like we're just going to wing it from here on yeah, out. Yeah, we're kind of mocking it. That's right, right? Except this is supposed to be long enough to reach all the way across. All right, so there must be another plate. A four. We need a two. Oh, plate. wait. No, because... Yeah. This isn't... Isn't this supposed to still open? It does. Have we prevented that? No. No, no, no. Uh, no, no. Okay, look at that. Doesn't that look like it? Except it we does. need another plate right in there. That's across there, and you can still see. Can you see the top of this? You can, right? I think so. Yeah, and there's supposed to be a piece that goes across here. The, something that goes here, but I'm not exactly sure what it is. <laughs> yeah, I know what it is. This is supposed to be over by one. Look. Can you get this off? There. This is supposed to be over one, and then that's oh, supposed to have a plate in there. Clever. So we need a one by four plate in there. Okay. It might be time. We may have to go to the, um, we may have to go to the, to the plate. The plate. collection. We might have to go to the collection. Wow, you guys, this is, I gotta say, like, pretty, Highly four. embarrassing. I'm not, I'm not embarrassed. I'm psyched. Look at that. Here we go. And again, we have not prevented anyone. And what from... ages was this for? <laughs> what goes here? We got to put plates across all this. Right? Oh, bye, Corey. Thanks so Three, much. Four, five, I love six. it, Corey Kinnick. Uh, bye bye, boys. Have fun storming the castle. <laughs> Thank you. I always appreciate a good Princess Bride uh, reference. All right, I think we okay, got this is, it. Something's mi a mess here. What's that? What do you mean? No, this is supposed to be a two and a three. It shows it. Oh, it is? Yeah, a two and a three plate. Yeah, okay, I have yep. the three and the two. Sorry, I'm just standing up here. Sometimes Perfect. Perfect. Dive in. From all right, I think that plate. we may be all caught up with this, this level of the Woo! instructions. Shh. Look at that. Whew. All right, I so because so, it's gonna bury everything we just did. I know. That's the worst. Okay, so it looks like 
Where are the twos? Could you bring those over? The one by twos? Mm -hmm. So it looks like we're going to start off with a one by two here. Let's start on one corner and work our way around and because otherwise it's going to get confusing. That's what I did. You're a step ahead. <laughs> so let's start here. And I think that's a no. one by four. Yes. That's a three. That's a two. And that's, and that's a four. That's a three. Look, can you see, you see the there's an edge there, right? I don't see an edge, but I don't know. Maybe. Well, I mean, in the end, it doesn't matter. Are there any so. fours? Yes, there's a four. We'll see what happens. And then a three. All right. And then is that an eight? Looks like an eight. And then another eight. There we go. Although it's that's not right. That goes. Oh, you know what? These old bricks are tight too. Sure, I feel like the plastic are. has shrunk. And it looks like a three, and then a four, and then a six, and then another six on the other side of the split, mm -hmm. and then a four. Now, let's let's start from this side now because I'm not quite sure what's happening here. So this gets a one by three red. Okay, look, now we're already in trouble here. I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna take this reel out because we're gonna be in trouble. We need a smaller reel. So we're gonna mock up the reel function for today. Hmm. I think that is a custom piece that the real enclosure it is I think is a solid custom piece it absolutely is and then it gets this on top supposedly oh and then the string and the string comes out of the hole all right but to keep moving on here we're gonna try what oh my goodness what made you want to do that you see, it's a three, and then there's a four, and there's another one, or sorry, here, like that. Well, what, but that's a solid four brick. Look, you can see. That That's a one oh, by four there. Oh, the one goes here, I see. Yeah. All right, so we need a one by four and a one by three. Did you already open the window in case you want to throw it out? I don't know, I'm getting ready. And then, can you see the break there? I think that eight. looks like an eight. And, and another, another eight. eight. Awesome, which makes this a one by three. I'm pretty sure. And then now we can do these crenellations, right? Oh my goodness gracious. Who would have ever thought that it would have been in this impossibly difficult? skip one I can't tell we're supposed to some of them get a um, like a one like that well I've got a one here maybe it looks like you just skip you skip one it looks like there's one there's one stud in between each one one two three four well one, my two, hats three, off to the I think I'm gonna have four. to change the I'm gonna have to change the the title card for this episode and be like Grandpa's put together vintage set part one. Oh, and then this one has three between. This is like a weirdo. It gets like three between. Maybe a couple of ones. And do you have any one by fours left in there? Nope. Well, probably one of these places where we put on a one by four. It was supposed to be a one by three. Yeah, but we can just what? we can grab one from the collection. Oh, I think I know. This is where you were absolutely correct, and I put the wrong piece on, which is not a surprise. Um, there really? Is, yeah, this was supposed to be a three and a one, so that it retains its open ability. No, no, three right there. And then there's a one that goes right there. 
And then it gets one of these here. And it gets another one here. Is that correct? I think I'm not going to make it past 1130 because my job is super heated up today. Mm. So we'll see how far we get, but I'm going to have to step out in a few minutes. And then this. All right. Look at that. Okay. So I think we have finally have the base of the castle. Here, let's All right. show it sideways where it's more fun. Right. Right. And then we'll find our custom real piece for right here, but the string comes out. And then probably, does it tie on to the... Yeah, it goes into the little there's thing a, there. There's a space there. We need to make a, we need to put a little wheel on this. Like one of those little, you know, or like, like a crank little crank something. wheels. Or a crank for now. A crank would work. Um, okay, I need to grab these red pieces on the other side of you, please. Okay. And this is going to get... Yeah, I wanted this to all be the here. same height. Here. Oh, look how clever they are. I'm such a silly monkey right there. Look, they've put a Technic uh, a headlight brick that has a yeah. hole in it here, and the string is going to thread through that oh, headlight brick. Oh, got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Very good. And I imagine the same thing is going to happen on the other side. Now, does that look like a one by one to you, or is that that's not also a snot brick? I don't think. No. Here, and I'll grab this snot for the other side. There we go. There, and I say I saved. Of course, I saved precious Lego string from the um, Technic crane that we built. That's right. So it is not vintage Lego string. <laughs> no, this is new Lego string. <clears throat> oh my God! We can finally move past the step. Okay, we got this one. Ah. Yeah, so now we're going to have another... Where's our other headlight brick? Do you have it? Yep, right here. But this isn't the right height. This needs two one by 3s Hang on. This is... Something's the wrong height here. This is a one by 3 brick there. It is. And then we got the two one by 3s and then this is here. So that means this is too tall. That's because of this thing. Maybe try making it two plates instead of a brick on the bottom. Well, I can just take off a plate here, too. Oh, that'll work. Was it just a plate too high? I don't know. No, it's two plates too high. Oh, my goodness. Well, we'll have that custom piece, and that'll be easy to swap out. All right. Oh, here we go. There we go. I love all this vintage red. It makes me, it reminds me of my childhood. Is this the same height now? So No, it's still off by a plate. Darn it. Okay, so I need two two by four plates to go in here. Wow. Who knew that this was gonna be so awesome. Yeah, I'm totally changing this to Hassle in the castle. I know he's probably wondering why he came back at this point. I totally get it. <laughs> there we go. All right, and so now, okay, here's the weird thing about this piece of string. This next one coming up. Okay, that works, right? Look, those are the same height. Yes. So yes, now, you're saying about string. So we're going to tie the string on here. Now, the next instruction on 17, mm -hmm. I want to show you this, actually. I'm going to I'm going to switch to the, um, I'm going to switch to the. Well, then I wonder, how did the kids in the 50s build anything at all? Because they had, like, five bricks to choose from. <laughs> because of all the, because their parents were carpenters okay. and, knew, and, and they could just... So check this out. Right here, I don't know if you can see my cursor or not, but right here on the corner on the right-hand side of the drawbridge. Can everybody see that? Yeah. Oh, are you not seeing that? Oh. No, it's not letting, it's not changing on here for some reason. Why? Well, I misunderstood the in we misunderstood the instructions. What it's telling us to do is take a long piece of string and go from the reel through the bottom uh, over to the other hole, and then oh, up, right? And yes, I, no, no, I don't think so, because that would make a string that goes across. And if you look, look at the picture, there it goes over there. 
Oh, I see. It goes and under there. Goes underneath. underneath. Got yeah, it. but since we only have so long of Lego string right now, okay. But we're this is what I want to show. This is what I want to show you. That's so. That's so weird. All right. Is that you've got? Why is it not showing the right thing? This is really frustrating. Wow, we are just having all. It is some kind of something today. I'm having fun. <laughs> some kind of something. Um. Oh, look at that. That's a not correct maneuver there. It's telling you to wedge the string between these two bricks. That's what I was trying to point out. So it's got this it's you got this weird thing where here is this going to show it this time? No, for some reason it's stuck on an older Well, you can image. come just show them the real model and we can just show it on the real model. Yeah, I wonder what um I wonder what changed. It's trying to it's trying to kill me. All right. No problem. That's it. That's a, all the there. instructions for you, friends. See this? It's telling you to pinch. So what we got wrong is the string goes from here, where we have this reel, down to the bottom here and goes through that. See that little technical, the half technical? And I tied it off there. But what it wanted is a longer string. The string goes under here, goes up through this technical, up here, and then ends being the perfect length right here, making these two <laughs> bricks out of system. Interesting. Right? I don't know if we can get a plate across that. So this goes here. And it looks like we're going to do two one by 2 red plates. I've got them. Ooh, look at these vintage red plates. We've got like nicks and scratches. Nice. Um, where's the red plates? Where do the red plates go? Right there. Over this hole? Mm -hmm. So they're just and there's floating. Another, another two on this side as well. There? Yep. Wow. Okay, and we put on the... This, I think this one has the least amount of parts. Oh, it looks like we're going to add two spears right here. And oh, should we be have in the, the bag. spears in the, yeah. in the awesome bag of horses and knights. Wow, y'all. Thanks for bearing with us through all this. <laughs> well, I went away, and I came back, and the room was on fire, and Logan was jumping on top of the couch. See what happens. See what happens. Oh, great. Okay, so now we've got, now that we've got this set up, the next step includes, like, 5,000 things that they don't show you, they don't point out. So there's, like, these and these Oh, I'm not sure what some of some of those things is hard to right. figure out what's going on there. So I think this I know that this goes here. Okay. And I know that the, there's another one that matches that goes it on, on the on other this. side, right? <laughs> and then we've got a stack of Part two Flynn's flying castle. It is true. <laughs> two three four. Like this. Yeah, that right. Or that is right. So on the corner of this right here, yeah, it looks like one, one two, two, three, three four, four, and then a and then a headlight brick but on the in to the inside. A, I don't know that we have a gray headlight brick out, do we? Yes, a headlight brick where here, right? And then is this a one by two here? Uh, it looks like a one by two with a one by one like directly behind, behind it. And you've got the one by one. Yep, and then, and we're then gonna we build make a the duplicate same. one for the other side. And is that at the same? It looks like mm -hmm. it's at the same right height. There. Yep. One, two. Oh no! Wait, it looks. Oh, I see. So there, on this side, there is. Oh, it's further back. Look. Right, but we have some other things to put. Are on there first. bricks? It, it looks, looks like, like there's, there's two by four bricks. It looks like there's a two by three brick here. Do you have that? I don't have a two by three, do you? Mm, yep, right here. Two by three brick here. Oh, look, it was even on screen. Ha ha ha. And then, is this just two one by ones? Yeah, Richard is Iceman. No, that's Iceberg. That's Mel, I'm afraid. You don't want to don't want to steal Mel's. <laughs> is so, right? is there another? Is there a one by three behind that? Kind of hiding there. I think so. I think there must be, because what right. what else would it be? And then that makes it a square that we can put these <laughs> one by ones on. 
Right, and now you can put your stack here. One stack like that, and then we got it. We need another headlight brick. Yeah, this is the. I think this is where the headlight brick is, right? Yeah. No, it's supposed to be four bricks high. Isn't it one, two, three? Oh, but remember oh. we added this brick in right. already, so yeah, it gets one. Okay, off so the top. I need the headlight brick. And then we're gonna do one here. Then. Mm -hmm. I need a headlight brick. Um, if we don't have it all, mm -hmm. I think I saw one. I thought I saw one. I knew I heard it. Gray headlight brick. We had it out. It has just disappeared in the melee. Well, I, it's funny. We've got tons here of... We don't want to use a wrong color headlight brick. On a gray castle. I don't know at this point. <laughs> what we've done, I feel like it's come together pretty well, given that it was a pile of bricks earlier today. It was, and um, or yesterday. I gotta say, this gives me like not that I don't already super respect her, but this gives me a, a new respect for new Tina's Lego respect. new Lego respect for Tina's skills as a young builder. Because holy bananas. Oh, maybe, check out this. Oh, that's not a Lego brick. Maybe you that. just need one of those. Cast go, Logan. Um, okay, yeah, well, I we're think we're going to you... go with a black one for right now, and then we can go back and switch it. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. All right, everybody. You seem so downtrodden. <laughs> Aren't you excited that we're that we have this castle almost together? Um, indeed. So it looks like we need two more Logan Chu Mega. Exactly, Moto. Two more one by two by two gray bricks here and here. Okay, one there is gonna lock that in. And I don't have an, I have another one. Look at that. And then two one two two by two plates go right on top of each of those. And we go back to vintage pieces there. Look at that. Literally like. And we put our spears shoe in. marks. We have our okay. I think we're now we're caught up with this page. Oh my goodness. Okay, now we've got some inverse. <laughs> uh oh. You're gonna make it. I don't know. <laughs> I may well lose my mind. Um, Let's, see. Let's see what happens. <laughs> exactly. Let's see what happens. Um, right? So these yeah, go in here right. like this. Right? Do we have something? Oh, there's little the little ladders. There's two little gray ladders. I got them. These are great vintage ladders. Look at this. All like patinaed and yellow. <laughs> sepia ladders so the ladder looks like it goes here on the edge of this and then there should be two gray inverse corner slopes that are going to go yep. that's going to go right here and here yeah this is definitely this has been casually casual with a dose of cuckoo bonkers so funny. Oh my so that goodness. is pinched in there. Oh, I see. The method only works, obviously, this makes sense, only works if you have one string. We're also, because you've got one reel here. Yeah, we're also um, missing a plate. As you can see, that it is off. It's going... <laughs> so I think that one of your plates needs to go back on here in the bottom. All right. We are going to put a... Is this one piece? Is it this one? Yes, I believe this is correct. No, don't put that on yet, please. I have to put the plate underneath it. See, I'm there not afraid go. to break things apart. I prefer not to take things apart because don't you hate when then it takes you an hour to make the studs fit again? Okay, I think this is this is now. So why don't you just untie these and tie it underneath? And that would give us our one piece of string. Does that sound? I think I can do that. Okay. And I'm going to grab these. There we go. Uh, so this will be a, a there'll be a 
a two version one and version two here. Oh, everybody is talking about making about making tricky lug official. Um, I know. Yeah, we are we are working on recognized Lego media. Although I don't know really. That won't work, Flynn. Hmm. It won't work because of the knot. I mean, it'll kind of work. We're gonna get yeah. this really working, but but it mostly works. Mostly. You are eliminated, Flittered. Oh my god, we've been so eliminated. Well, so does that mean that these are regular? So these are corner pieces. Yeah, that makes sense for all of those. But then we need a couple of cubes in here. There's something missing here. Oh no, that's no, supposed it's just to kind be. of like hanging out. And then are there aren't there supposed to be cubes oh, filling in these spaces? Yeah. Yep, exactly. Now, is that a corner piece or is that a straight piece? Is it? I have no idea what's supposed to be. It looks there. like a corner. A corner. Me. All right. I mean, uh, there's four corners on each of these. Yep, makes sense. And, and then, then we need probably... a one by one there. Yep. And then we're gonna put some nice, satisfying plates on top of this stuff. I probably, I'm gonna predict these are going up here, but we'll see. I'm gonna need a drink after this. <laughs> I'm not going to say what kind of drink, but some kind of beverage. Maybe High C. <laughs> exactly. A fresca. Oh, so you think that that's what goes there? I think so. That's my prediction. And uh, I'm right. You. you assumed. And it well, wasn't a disaster. I'm that's the awesome. Kreskin of Lego. <laughs> there we go. Very good. Oh, and then we just do a round of these. Not no. Oh, it goes on the it goes on the corner bits like that. And then these go in between. Look at that, we blaze through those eight bricks. And then I bet more crinolations. It's like the fastest right? thing that we've ever done um, on this model. More crenellations. Oh, no, we got this to do. So we've got, there's some arches. Oh, wait. Okay, so we need some uh, plates here, it looks like. Is it one by two plates? Right here and here? I can't tell if those are mm -hmm. one by twos. I don't have any one by two plates. I have, maybe they're one by four plates. Then. How about one by threes? Yeah, it doesn't show exactly, right? Like you we go from. Oh yeah, look, it's one by twos, one here and one okay, there. Those. All right. And now I'm going to put on these guys. One here, one here. Thank you. Here and there. And then I'm having trouble without zooming in, telling what's behind those in the next step. Yeah, I can't either. It looks like there isn't anything. It looks like- Well, why is there maybe... a row of studs back oh, there? Oh, I see. It's not a whole row of studs. It's just one of these each, which would make sense. That makes sense, because you want your little knights to hang out there. Right. Next to the murder holes. Okay, so now we are doing two Oh, I know. For, I know that we don't have these. I so those think. are murder holes. <laughs> Welcome to Murderville. No, that's what they call them, right? <laughs> don't they call them murder holes? Because <clears throat> the guys try to climb up in ladders. So we need a couple of those things, and I know. Right. I know we know right where they are. Um. All right. So this has green and white flags, and we were able to find all the green flags, but we only, for some reason, had two white flags because you never have the piece that you think. Yeah. Um. There we go. Perfect. All right. So this is gonna have a white flag and a green flag. Green. We're gonna do another white and green. Like this. 
And yes, it is in fact asking for all of those extra crenellations on the top now. Okay. So I'm liking this. Like it makes these. me want to buy some vintage gray pieces to fill out, you know, so, in, any of the newer ones with older ones. And it's and interestingly, instead of using corner pieces, they are using one by twos and one by ones. I wonder if corner pieces weren't a thing if yet. If they were less of a thing. So are we doing crenellations over here too? Yep. On I just sides. like saying crenellations. I know. Better crenellations than crenellins. Really? Yeah, I don't, I don't know. I don't know if I agree with that. I would but think okay. they're scratchy, wouldn't you? I, I don't know. know. I've never had I a crenellin I can tell you on. from experience that they're not scratchy. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see. All right. Where do our little... Oh, and it looks like we get more on top of our little arches here. So... Here. Crenellation here. All right, that works. And then we've got all the ones down here. And yep. we've preserved the ability to open, right? Yeah, it opens in the back. But let's let's uh, figure out where these. Yay! Oh, hooray! Get night. So the little flags go here. And here, right? I want the knight on the black horse. So we have um, we have a couple of things. So we have this guy, and but he doesn't have his proper. So these are the minifigs, everybody, that we have from this um, from this show. Let's see. We ha I think we have the we have the denizens of the castle. Right? We have the black horse. We have one of our guards so this guard gets Oops. um i got it in he gets a spear this guy with the pointy helmet and then this guy with a bullet helmet and the and the uh, thing gets a bow and arrow and he goes up on there it yeah. looks like and this guy goes here they're very happy about Oop. their you know about their life in the castle that was impossible to build. Yeah. Yeah, they're probably glad that they didn't have to build it. They didn't have to build it. <laughs> they just hang out there and defend it. Um, so we did have... So we do have pieces sort of for the other ones. We have this guy who gets black legs with sort of like a red. So we're missing... Out of six minifigures, we're missing three and a half minifigures. But we do have... The original helmet, and we're missing a yellow saddle for one of our guys. Yeah, we so do we have this. provided blue saddles on both, right? We have this. We're missing a little plume for this guy. Well, do we want to make some but, kind of figs to put on these horses? Yeah, we can. Well, we can take these guys if you want. And there's also a couple of shields, which we have one of. I know I saw yeah. one shield. Well, why don't we turn around to the front camera right. and we can see how cool this thing is. We have a few pieces left over. Not sure what. Well, some of them were custom, custom work. They were, and this is. I'm just gonna get rid of that. All right. So let's tilt down here, and you can see right there. Now, if this was a single string going underneath here, I would be oh. able to turn the crank and pull the drawbridge up and it would go up smoothly and then go back down again. So we have this little shield here and there's supposed to be a yellow version of it on this side where we have that open space. And then there are two more shields. So there's supposed to be two of each shield. So we have most there's everything more here, right? Yeah, we just have a few accessories here and there, but for the most part we have, um, we have lots of the pieces. So that was a trip to the past. I was a freshman in high school when this was new. Oh, hello, person is in Oakland. Very good. Ooh, Welcome. We go. Welcome. Say hello. Um, this has been, um, yeah. This has been one of the kookier episodes. It's, I went yeah. away on a, oh on a business call, and, and it melted down. Melted down. I'm so glad you all were here 
to take care of Flynn while I was away on the business call because I think he needed a little help. <laughs> oh, so the castle, um, if you remember, so here I'll go back. Um, yes, it is a castle. It's an original castle from 1984, the Knights oh, Castle. Oh, 1984, not 80? 84. Oh, so the I was The stickers at, were 80. So I was a senior in high school. So this opens, there is, remember one of the very first things we did was put in two Technic bricks with a pin. There we go. And then the thing opens like this. And by the way, we did build in, there's like a little jail cell right here that opens with a little door. You can't see it because it's black, but yeah. It opens up and it's got, they, they put a one by two plate as a handle on it. That was <laughs> nice. Look, no stickers, right? Oh. Oh my, I can't even imagine. Well, I'm just saying, like, this was an early set, and stickers were... Well, we know there were stickers early, but not for right. this set. Well, I mean, I, what I would like to do is... Um, uh, what I there would like go. to do is find out um, how we could get the remaining pieces. Although I feel like the minifigures would probably really be really expensive. Well, I mean, for a vintage set like this, if you're talking real... I mean... We're not going to buy a $20 minifigure, but, you know, we could pay a little bit for minifigures to finish up. And maybe for set. a couple of those shields. Yeah. Oh, I could build a 25-piece castle hooded one. It would be micro, micro but I could totally build a 25-piece castle. Absolutely. Uh -oh, is that a challenge? It feels like someone threw down the Lego gauntlet. Oh, wow. Really? Okay. I don't just, know. I, I just made gonna, that up. I was going to do Belleville, but if you want me to try and do a micro castle of 25 pieces, I will absolutely do it. Will you have all the green flags? Well, I think... Probably not. I think you did a great job of, like, managing to recreate this little... The little winder thing. Well, we're going to... Um, oh, there we go. Yeah, I think we can... <clears throat> we'll do a little bit better than that. I'll get the right size string. I love using the half exposed um, Technic plate under here to hold the string. Hooded one, do whatever you do, whatever you like. <laughs> do what okay. you like. Have a neck bump. I thought you were challenging. I was ready to. No, I, mean, I take made up the challenge. I made up the challenge. Oh, you made right, it up. Yeah, right here on the spot, sitting oh, that's next right. to you. I did. Oh, my goodness. Um. Oh I want you here to know go. that right here is a dog with his head on my leg patiently for who knows what. But he's going to get a cookie after for that. all that. My goodness. Well, this is certainly, yes, this certainly was one of our more eventful episodes. That's um, great. I love old sets. We have a classic space set that I want to put together. Um, we have a Technic helicopter that I'd like to put together. So just a reminder, everybody, before we sign off, that we oh, are yeah. doing a giveaway when we hit 2,000 subscribers. And surprise, not surprisingly, our subscriber count did not go up during this episode. What? <laughs> oh. Um, we will be giving away this uh, Monkey King Warrior mech when we hit 2,000 subscribers. Such a fun set, and we got to talk with the designer. We did, and don't forget there's gonna be a bunch of giveaways happening on Sunday for our 100th episode. Yeah, come join us on Sunday. I mean, always join us on Sunday because it's just a fun chat, but we have some extra special stuff this one. Yeah, so, um, and then there was, what was the other thing? Oh yes, Tiago Caterino next week. Very yeah, that's exciting. so exciting. Uh, I love when we get be, to talk to designers. That's gonna be really a lot of fun. And thanks everybody for um, for yeah bearing with us through that. <laughs> My goodness. Well, you know, I figured if we you... have fun, who here has not hit roadblocks with Lego sets before? You ever yes. just like put it down? Like I'm coming back to this later. <laughs> and then six months later, you're like, that was just a one by three. What was the point? Yes, and hopefully, and then hopefully, in three months later, nobody's actually watching this video. Oh my goodness! I'll watch it. <laughs> I'll watch it. I love these little horses. I want to get horse armor. We have actually cool red horse armor, like dragon armor. Yeah. Hey, uh, myself, kid. How's it going? Oh, this was in your recommended? Wow, that means we're actually getting popular enough that, um, that we're showing up on recommended. Zach that's Martinez right. says, oh, I'm sorry, showing up on recommended? Well, that's cool. Yeah. Absolutely. Zach Martinez says, awesome build and chat today, guys. Exclamation point. Had so much fun today. Thanks again for the birthday wishes, Tricky <laughs> Lug. Well, we had a lot of fun celebrating your birthday with you, too. 
That's, you know, even when Lego sets, you know, don't go exactly the way you expect, it's that puzzle game quality exactly. to it that I really like. Well, I, I, you know, you've been through us, uh, you've been uh, with us through the good and the not so good, so we appreciate it. Uh, but yeah, don't forget, Sunday is our 100th episode. We're, we're trying to get to those 2,000 subscribers as well. Not by Sunday, they're kind of separate things. <laughs> Come up here. Um, if you Come want here. to send us something uh, to our P.O. Box, you can do so at P.O. Box 11517, Oakland, California, 94611. Um, don't forget, you got your 25-piece challenge that's due tomorrow at 5 p.m. We won't be here to remind you. So here's no, your reminder. Tomorrow at 5 p.m. Yeah, when I get off work, I'm going to start processing the photos. And I'm going to build my 25-piece challenge tonight. Yes, I'm looking forward. I'm actually going to do some fun. I'm actually going to do some Belleville, I think. And I might do the 25-piece castle just because. Who knows? Who can it's say? It's just 25 It's a pieces. crazy world. Um, so, yeah, world. have we hope that you all have a great day today. And we will be showing our slideshow on Friday. Uh, don't forget to hit that like button, hit that subscribe button if you haven't. Oh my goodness. He's like, are there cookies? Yes, out there? he can smell the bag of cookies. <laughs> he can smell the bag of You're cookies over there. Not subtle at all. Um, and we just so before we go, we just wanted to remind everybody to please uh, stay safe, stay healthy, wash, wash your, your hands, hands, wear your mask, and we yep. will see you Friday at 10 a.m. Thanks everyone. Bye everyone. Bye.